Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of Pisces, for love and relationship, for March There are a lot of deep emotions, setbacks, from a person that want to come back to you, dear Pisces. They are trying to rush you to have a future with you and come back to you. And they believe that you are looking into yourself and you don't really want to be doing, taking them back. Um, dear Pisces, I'm getting here that... Um, You want someone from your past like you know, to see the light or shed lights about what they have done to you. And at this time like you know that you are telling them that you want to look into themself, uh, yourself. It's like you know that you might be really want to, uh, to get married to someone. You might but because I'm getting here it's a lie. You might be really just like you know trying to play games on that person because they played games on you in the past. This person, like you know, from your past, is holding back on you, uh, is holding on you, wants you, and waiting on you to let them in, but they are having bad luck right now because you are not allowing the situation to happen. They want to be about it to you, they want to come back to you, they want to be in your life. You feel that, you know, you need your freedom at this time. You don't really like to want to connect right away. It's like some of you want your ex back, but you want like you know, some time to connect with them because you are not really pleased right now with their statements or the way they are. And some of you, they don't want, you don't want to be really connecting with this person at all. Like, you know, I'm getting here two signs. Your person feels sorry like you know, about what they have done to you in the past. They want to come back. They want to reach out for you. They want your responsibility. Uh, they still love you. They care for you. But you become undecided and you feel like you're know, really more confident to slow this relationship down. This is your confidence to slow it down or to let it go because you feel like you're really very good by yourself as you healed a lot from the past. And by telling this other person no, you are healing more and you become more confident. It's really strengthening your energy for some reason. Your person here and decided if you are uh, uh, about like, you know, uh, love and relationship somewhere else. Like, you know, they want to renew this relationship between you two. And they are worried about you. You might really feel your, their anxiety also, like, you know, coming to you. You are shocked and surprised about, you know, your decision at the end, like, you know, you are saying this no to the other person, or for some of you, slowing it down. You feel like, you know, that you are connecting with a new love or someone new. Because you are having dreams, like, you know, about really someone new. This is the dreams I'm really getting here. You are having dreams with a new love. That's what I'm seeing here. You have a new love. You are connected with a new love. And you are having dreams about this person. You, another person, not really the, uh, someone from your past. And you want really like to connect with them. The new person that you want to go on with, like you know, they feel confident in you also. They have been dreaming about you too. Or it could be like you no know, connection like you no know, between you two as... Sleepless, waking up in the middle of the night, go back to sleep again. They worry, you You have anxiety, the other person have anxiety toward each other. You feel each other anxiety a little bit, 
but it's not a bad anxiety at this time because this person that you want to connect with, the new person, it feels to me that they are confident in you to make them happy. They are coming through. This person is coming through. It's like you waited on this person for a while and you want this person to be with you. This is really like you know, a sudden decision that you are doing at this time here because I'm getting two relationships. Someone from your past want to rush you to get married to you at this time or to be intimate with, uh, I'm sorry, to be in a relationship with you in a committed one, either you are slowing it down or for others like, you know, you don't want to because you want to connect with this, with this new love. You have been really slowed down with your emotions, with someone from your past here. This person undecided what to do and they have been crying and emotional because you are turning them down. They are unhappy because they are aware that you have another relationship and they don't like it. That's your ex. They want to come after you more, your ex, because you, they know that you are establishing a new relationship here. And you feel like, you know, that maybe I need some time to feel myself or to free myself from any pain that your ex caused you in the past. Dear Pisces, I see that you have so much fear to decline your person, like you know, someone from uh, your past. They done you wrong before in the past. Some of you like you know that uh, they had an affair with someone else, your ex, and you feel like you know, that you want to decline them, or you want to walk away, or you slow it down. But there is that fear. This is mean that it's not really something done one hundred percent for you to, for you like you know, be to be declining this person one hundred percent. Even if you told them that's it, I'm done. Really, I mean it. I'm done. But when I see that fear. It's not really something is over there. Your ex like you knows that you are establishing a new relationship and said, what, you are moving on from me? You are getting married? You are happy? They gossip about you here. They don't believe it. They don't want you to do that. It's like, you know, they cannot stand it, like, you know, as you decline them to move on with another relationship. But you are lucky no matter what the situation is, is like, you know, what other decisions that you make here is really very good for you. I see, like, you know, your ex, like, you know, if you are financially secure or establishing a business, they are after money. But for some of you, they want to build this relationship with you. And some of you, like, you, know, you, you want, like, you know, to make other decision, like, you know, to establish business with you also. For a lot of you, I see that, you know, that you are lucky to end this relationship with the ex. But it is up to you because you did an effort and you are willing to do little effort, but not anymore. You feel like, you know, that you need to find yourself right now. For a lot of you, I see it's over. Um, but not everybody, though. So if you are a Pisces waiting on someone from your past, they will come back to you for sure. And I see that, you know, it's already happening, and you will take them back. For some of you, slowing it down. For some of you, rejecting it 100%. So not everybody, like, goes the same. If you are seeking this new relationship with someone else, I get here is going to be really very good healing for you, progress. Because the love will be like from both sides, back and forth. I'm getting here that electricity, like you know, uh, like you, know, you feel like you know, that electricity between you and this uh, person, like you know, that connection. Um, it's really beautiful. You connect on the highest level. Your ex is mad. If you don't want to take them back, look at this. They are mad and angry. Look at that. And they are hoping and making like you no know, wishes and plans for you, for you to take them back.
you need to meditate on your situation here because I get here that even you let them go but you're still protective over them. Your ex like you know, is gonna try harder here because every time I wanna try like you know, to connect with the, this new relationship, your ex jumping in the picture, their energy is so uh, heavy, little bit. What's gonna happen here along the line? With the ex. Some of you positive communications and you are going to open that door and it's going to be really very good and for some of you it's going to be really a total isolation like we said with the new with the new love what's going to happen it's not going to establish like no really very good in the beginning along the run but there is that happiness momentarily but there are a lot of things like you know, for you to work on and it's going to end up in marriage for sure that's the new relationship so the new relationship is going to be like you know, going steps, stages. At the end, there is that actual marriage. Because why the new relationship is not really going to connect really very good in the beginning, because you need to let go what hurt you from your past if you are letting go your exes. And um, your expectations always from that other person always hurt you. Because I think or I, I do feel that you did really a lot of good things and uh, the other person or your ex like you no know, did not really do much or they hurt you with too many things like you no know, they disappoint you so that's why you are hurt if you let go everything and stop like you no know, really thinking about it and let it go to the universe um, release it that's what I meant forgive it forgive yourself but what's gonna happen you will be much happier from now on dear Pisces I hope you enjoy your reading and if you want a private reading, please contact me on mysticalaziza.com. The link is below this box, this video in the description box. And um, there is a link for donation. Please like you know, put your do donations there and that will help me tremendously. And thank you so much for watching. Thank you. Bye-bye.